Sagittarius, come on in, put your feet up, make yourselves at home, I'm Jindos, and welcome to Chat TV. All right, Sag, this is your timeless love reading. Bear in mind, well, these are general readings, so it's not going to resonate with all of you, but if it does, take a look in the description box below. There's a link to my Patreon if you want to watch extended videos. There's also a link to my website if you want to book a private reading. There are a lot of scammers out there. So if you want a legitimate private reading with me, you have to come to my website. There's a link below, gentvtarot.com. That's the only way. I'm not going to be up in your DMs. I'm not going to be down there in the comments below. You have to come to me. Mm, I just ate a piece of cucumber and it was delicious. <laughs> I haven't just like eaten raw cucumber like that. Well, you always eat cucumber. I don't know. What oh my God, it was so good. Oh. Tasty. I haven't done that for years. <laughs> Just like cucumber. Mm. Anyway, Sagittarius, your timeless love reading. One more. All right, go on then. Sorry if you hear my cat starting to fight. They, uh, <laughs> they've just been fed. I can still hear the meeting now, but uh, usually at the end of <laughs> at the end of the meeting, there's a little bit of a fight because one finishes before the other, and the, the one that finished first is like, "Well, there's food still, so I'll eat yours." So uh, yeah, there's usually a bit of a fight. They're they're competitive like that. I'm teaching my cat Gary to touch a button that says food and when he touches the button I feed him. He's learning it! I got it. he just done it! He's like, if I, you mean if I touch this you'll feed me? <laughs> Alright. I'm teaching a cat something. This is amazing! He does it. Barry on the other hand is like, mm, no. No, you'll just feed me, woman. I'm not touching a button. It's beneath him. Anyway, sorry. You don't want to hear me going on about my cats. Total cat lady here. Sagittarius. This is your timeless reading. The overall vibe here. We've got the Seven of Swords in reverse. I kind of want to... I sort of want to say that this is you kind of breaking free of something. Letting something... Not letting it go, like literally freaking breaking free like a bat out of hell, actually. <laughs> Tell me more. You are, you're running, you're, you've, you've broken free. Somebody who, this person, they're, they're like, I don't think they're a terrible, terrible person, but I kind of want to say they were always unable to deliver. They kept you waiting around for a long time. They made you promises. If you just wait, I'll give it to you. Just wait a bit longer, I'll give you that thing that, you know, I've been telling you, I'm going to give it to you. Well, you know, if you give up now, you're not going to get that thing that you've been waiting so long for. You've had to just go... If I don't leave now, that's it. You feel like you've wasted a lot of time. This person was never going to deliver on these by whatever it is, they were never going to deliver. 
and every time you hung on they were like oh my god i can't believe you they, they held on a bit longer well we'll see when the conversation comes up again So, your feelings on this are freaking run. Just like, get out of here. Swift, fast, get out of here. I, I've wasted enough time on your buffoonery. Tell me more. This person took away your self confidence. And made you feel like you didn't have a choice but to wait around. It's my illumination. It's it's literally just my computer screen. <laughs> yeah, I, I'm not turning my lights on because they're too bright. And I end the reading light. I can't see anything. You're you're you've had to. sort of feel like in a way you had to break out and leave I think that you actually love this person and you've listened to them and listened to them and, and been so patient and waited and waited and they've never delivered and you've just gone oh, I, I, I can't anymore I can't no it doesn't matter what you feel this is your thoughts now it didn't matter how much you love them you can't wait around for this undelivered promise. And this is what you don't know. We've got the two of pentacles. I don't like that. Why are the two of pentacles there? I mean, that's a fine card, but for some reason I really don't like it. It's giving me bad vibes. <laughs> Tell me why that's there. <gasps> I knew it. I freaking knew it. I freaking knew it. This is why I don't like it. So what you don't know is that you're not the only person that they were making promises to. And I think the worst part of it is they delivered on the promise to somebody else. Tell me more about that. Did they did, did, did they deliver on the promise to somebody else? Oh, Jesus. Yes, very much so. Oh, I know exactly what this is. I think that you have been with this person for years. And... You have been very loyal and you've stood by this person. And I think that the promise was we can't have kids this year or we can't get married this year or something. I think it's kids. We can't do that now. We can't do that now. We haven't got enough money to do it now. We need a bigger house to do it. We'll do it uh, 10 years later, something like that. Years have gone by. And... I sort of feel in the last few years they've kind of switched over to somebody else. Been kind of juggling you with somebody else. And uh, I think that they gave what you wanted, what they promised you to somebody else. We've got that with the tower. What you should do about it? Six of Wands. Look at this. This person is very much in their power. They are winning. Their head is up high. They are, I, I'm on this horse. I got my Six of Wands. I'm winning. What you should do about it? You just, you just go. You just keep winning. Don't you let this person hold you down. Don't you let this person hold you back. 
Don't let this person keep you from your desires and your wishes. You, you are the Six of Wands. Tell me more about this Six of Wands. Yep. We've got the Ten of Cups in reverse. We've got um, Karma in reverse. Karma in this deck. What's it called? Um, can't think of the word. Judgment. <laughs> can't think of it. Consequences, my love. What goes around comes around. You know? They've kept you waiting. They're not going to be happy. I don't think they actually really wanted with this other person. <laughs> I don't think they wanted it and they they got it anyway I think they got trapped so yeah that's their consequences you hold your head up high my love you walk away from this you 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 keep running they like you've you've had to break free the outcome king of swords in reverse is them total butthole I am in charge everyone you know Everyone do as I say. They manipulate you to doing things their way. That's the way this person is and the outcome is that that's, that's that person. That's them. That's all you're ever going to get from them. So what you're doing right now, running. Good. And this is why you got to be six of ones as well, like holding your head high and like there's you've done nothing wrong because there's going to be a lot of that. People are going to be talking. You just make sure that they're talking about them and what a butthole they are. <laughs> Let people know. This person never delivers on their promises. And if this person is all like, yeah, well, I got what I wanted out of it. No, they haven't. You just be like, okay, honey. Yeah, all right. My friend Neil bought me some new cards today. A little deck but it's beautiful it's lovely love it this is a sign it's time for you to get on with you get on with your life and all that time that you wasted with this person you get on with you now I'm going to take it into extended after I've read these oracle cards or I'm going to ask about this person. I'm going to ask about them. How do they really feel about you? Where are you in their heart space? What are their intentions towards you? Uh, what do they want to say to you? And some guidance from the universe. But let's read these oracle cards first. Your dreams need a practical plan. So, all right, where are you going to be in a year's time? Set it up. Make it happen. Well, if I'm going to be here in a year's time, then I need to do this in a week's time. And I need to do this in a month's time. And I need to do this in two months' time. Sort yourself out. Get your plan in action. Your love lyric for the day is... And now I wake up with a sheet so wet and a freight train running through the middle of my head. Only you can cool my desire. Oh, oh, oh I'm on fire. Please tell me you know who that's by. <laughs> Come on, comments below. I need this coming in the comments below. Talk to me. Don't forget to like, subscribe and hit that notification bell. And if you want to watch the extended, take a look in the description box below. There's a link to my Patreon. You'll find the video there.